Looking for that perfect game for your gaming console? Video Game Corner is the largest independently owned video gaming store in North Mississippi, located at 1519 Highway 72 in Corinth. We are an authorized limited run retail store and have a massive collection of retro games and game systems and also plush toys and collectibles. We also pay top dollar for your used video games. Check them out Monday through Saturday from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. Visit Video Game Corner in Corinth. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a long time since I found a fan fiction that has actually very much so warmed my heart with how good it is. And ladies and gentlemen, The Ice Prince is one of them. Now before we get into this, understand that The Ice Prince is not only just a Harry Potter and Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood crossover. No, no, no. It also crosses over, honest to God, Ruby, Attack on Titan, and so many others, I wish I was joking. This fanfiction is a ambitious one and executes it perfectly. And that in itself is astounding. But the best part is that not only is it Dumbledore bashing, which is very good, it's also Wizarding World bashing as well, showing that your state of secrecy was developed during the Dark Ages, during the witch hunts, when the separation of magic and non-magic was a necessity for survival. But this story, as a whole, is so much more. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention Black Butler as well. And we'll get into that, I assure you, because the way everything is set up is beautiful. But let's go ahead and get into the starting point and the rest of it. I don't want to spoil for you because I want you guys to read this yourself. So let me go ahead and just talk off of how this started. It happens when Harry Potter is abandoned in the north, yes, the north, of, um, of the Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood's uh, nation, I'm not going to say the fucking name of it because I cannot pronounce it for shit, where General Briggs, Olivia, yes, that General Briggs, is, finds Harry and essentially adopts him. At which point in time, his features change. No longer does he have emerald eyes and needs black hair that we all know. No. In reality, he has blue, he has the same type of eyes as his mother and quote-unquote father, Miles, who, yes, I'm going to spoil a little bit of you. They do tie the knot, and yes, they actually do have another kid. So, um, for those of you who are shipping Miles and Livia, this, this one does do it very well, and I fucking love it. But he does have white hair, much like his father. And aside from that, he also has two companions. One is the bastard child of Voldemort, the daughter of Voldemort. And the other one is a Ishvalan. And again, I love it. I really do. Because when they introduce themselves to the Wizarding World... They're not going in blind. In reality, they're given fair warning in the fact that Dumbledore is a manipulative bastard and uh, actually told that don't trust the fu don't trust him. And yeah, each character in of this three team actually works out really well, and they do go through the books relatively quickly. They aren't bullshitting around. This is the same fast pace of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood but at the same time, done well. In fact, this does follow the same process of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood 
in terms of the plot in the background, but our primary focus is on the son of the Northern Wall, the Briggs Wall, the child of Olivia Armstrong. And this guy is literally, his middle name is Rex Armstrong. Rex Armstrong. I would try and say his first name, but I'm not going to because I'm not going to try and butcher that. But overall, the 40 chapters that this is, and yes, sad to say, this story may very well be abandoned. But this is a good example of how a massive crossover, at least using a lot of elements from different anime and even internet shows, works very well. Because each, fa each character is introduced as a part of a faction. Even the Attack on Titan characters are introduced as a part of a certain penile, um, or penal, uh... Regiment of sorts. Not only that, but each character from Black Butler is introduced as a member of the family, or at least as a faction of the Crown. In fact, the Crown does play a big role in the story, and again, is done very tastefully, very well, and executed perfectly. This story in all 40 chapters is one I recommend anyone to read if you're a huge fan of Harry Potter crossing over, or even just a huge Full Metal Alchemist fan, because they do actually talk about alchemy. In fact, many of the elements from the show where they, between Harry Potter and Full Metal Alchemist, because a lot of times they assume that alchemy is just another form of magic, and they assume that people from this nation are muggles, essentially. Well, Colonel Roy Mustang, the father, the adoptive father, mind you, and very protective of uh, the bastard child of Voldemort, would like a word with you in the fact of, with a snap, he can burn your ass to the ground. Again, this story is fucking perfect. There are many twists and turns. Truth himself, that dark being, wide-grinned bastard, actually does have a second persona, and one that actually makes a lot of sense, and is scary that it makes a lot of sense. And again, I love it. I really do. But either way, ladies and gentlemen, I, I'm not, I'm, I, like I said, I'm not going to spoil much for you. I want you to go read this yourself. And for those of you, my friends and authors out there, I want you to see if maybe you can adapt this yourself. Because, again, this story is really good. It has a lot of good elements. And who knows? I may take a look at more Harry Potter crossing over with anime that actually does well and actually does blend elements well. Again, there's a lot to it, and there's so many of them that I have to shift through that either don't make a lot of sense or just plain garbage. And I'm not going to review plain garbage for my own health. Thank you very much. Either way, though, ladies and gentlemen, as always, I've been Airsoft Al, and if you want to, and if you want to recommend a fan fiction from Wattpad, AO3, or otherwise to review, let me know in Discord because I am in the author's Discord where other authors share their works. And as much as I want to say that I will continue on the Harry Potter, ladies and gentlemen, next time we take a look at a romance story in Star Wars and what happens when Captain Rex finds a certain N7 and. Well, romance blooms on the battlefield, if you know what I mean. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Airsoft Al. And all links to not only, of course, this fanfiction, but also the Discord, and even the PayPal is in the links down below. But if you want to help support me directly, know now I have an Amazon account. So if you want to figure out how to help me through that, contact me via Discord down below. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Airsoft Allen. I will see you lovely, lovely people in the next media reviews. Till next time.